the Destroyers team reporter Kelly Stitz, joined by head coach Matt Sock. Coach, thanks for joining me. Yeah, thanks for having me. Of course. Now, first year in the books as head coach for the Destroyers. Overall, how was this first year for you? Uh, it, was, it, was, it was a difficult year. I mean, obviously, when you only win one game, it's tough. Um, you know, I think that we found a lot of good young talent uh, that most teams won't have, uh, you know, going into this next year. So I'm excited about the future. Obviously, I was disappointed about the season. But I think overall, you know, putting the team together in 30 days, um, I'm happy with the coaching staff and I'm happy with the front office. I think they did a great job. As you mentioned, you ended the regular season 1-11, but if you kept up with the team and followed them, you would know that the talent of the team didn't reflect a record this season. We were in every game. That's the biggest thing. 10 out of 12 games, we were within probably a touchdown or so. And that's doing it with the rookie quarterback. And basically every person on offense was a rookie except for one. So, uh, you know, not having Donovan early on, I think kind of hurt us a little bit, having that veteran leadership. But uh, again, overall, I think the team fought hard on every game. Um, and again, I, I'm excited about what we have in the future. Now you were working with a very young team this season, especially with a rookie quarterback and a lot of rookies on offense. Was that challenging for you to help build up the team? <laughs> it's, it's hard, you know, because veterans know what to do. You know, they understand the game. Um, rookies, they have to learn the game. They have to learn how to run routes. They have to learn how to catch near the wall. Um, just the rules of the game, it, there's just so much to do. And you have limited amount of time to do it. And camp really isn't long enough for that. So they have to learn during the year. Um, and again, I think the guys did a great job. Um, I, you know, I wish we had a little bit more veteran leadership on, on the offense, but uh, that's the way it worked out. Uh, next year, the good thing is that all those guys will be vets and they'll understand the game a lot better. And you were a quarterback in the Arena Football League as well. And so, you know, you understand what the transition between outdoor and indoor. And Grant was a rookie starting quarterback too. Uh, how, how was his performance overall, in your opinion? Um, it, it was up and down, as any rookie would be. Um, you know, he had times where he played really well. And there's times where he played really bad and that's just that's a rookie life and um, you know the good thing is that you know he got in thousands of throws this year uh, so that next year you know he'll be a lot more comfortable so like I you know like I said it's for him to come in it's it's learning a new offense it's learning how to uh, play underneath the center uh, which he's never done um, and then you know he's 23 years old and he's going against guys that are in their 30s so it is tough it, it's new it's it's a unique experience, but again, I thought he grew uh, well this year. What would you like to improve on moving forward? Um, our turnovers. I, you know, offensively, we had a ton of turnovers, um, you know, which again, I think can lead to having so much youth. Um, so next year, our goal will be to cut down those turnovers, and if we do, I think we'll win games instead of lose them. Did you have a goal in mind going into this season? I mean, yeah, I, I had two goals. One was win at least five games, which we didn't get there, and then make the playoffs. Um, those were two goals that, that were really important to me, and you know, obviously we, we didn't reach them. Um, next year will obviously be, uh, you know, six or more wins, and then obviously the playoffs. Were you satisfied with the performance of your defense throughout the season? I mean, they had a lot of veterans compared to the offense. Yeah, I think they did great. I, you know, again, you're, you know, the, I think we ended up third in the league in, in total defense. Um, but again, you look at the amount of turnovers we had on offense, and for them to still be there, it's pretty impressive. So if we can cut that out, there's no doubt that our defense, I think, would have been one of the top ones in the league. Now you're heading into the off season. Any plans? I'm going to rest for about a week, um, and then we'll start looking at uh, rookies again. Uh, we'll start calling guys, uh, just getting them ready for next year. Um, so our goal this year is to really just start recruiting early, uh, get on the phone, start calling guys, be the first person to call them. And that, that to me is important. First season in the books as head coach and heading into the off season. Make sure to relax. It's well deserved. Thanks for joining me. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thanks for having me. Thanks. For the Destroyers, I'm Kelly Ann Stitz.